I like the little one. Yeah, the little one. Oh my gosh. It's 18 dollars. This one's round. Yeah, those are cute. Falsta. Oh. So these are actual foxes. <laughs> But these ones are actually options. We could just get you have lots of. It's just a pig. I don't think anything's just a pig. I have found the most amazing planner stickers. They've sloshed all of them. Well, it's a whole pack of animals, but there's a whole page of sloths. It's good. Hey, mom. Hey, mom. This is gorgeous. It is. Yes, that is very gourd. Yes, it is indeed gorgeous. You can't see the fan I've got on my face. This is the one for dad. I only have pies for you. <laughs> okay, hello and welcome to or back to my channel. I've already filmed this clip, but I'm refilming because I wasn't actually filming. I was just standing in Michael's doing this. But we just went to Michael's to get a planner. This week I wanted to bring you guys along because I got my first video suggestion in comments to film another week in life, but from the view of online schooling and I thought showing me getting used to it would be pretty exciting we're doing some exciting stuff this week but we just got my me a planner i'll show you guys that when we get back now we're off to indigo to get some books because i'm in a lit class and have to go read actual novels so we're going to do that i might get a starbucks drink and i'll see you guys in a minute i want this book anti-racist baby it looks amazing i just found a case to five case and i'm really excited about it like so excited that section usually has milk tea, but it wouldn't roll back and now they're sold out. I don't know how I'm going to be able to study. Maybe with my friend's thing. Okay, bye now. We're home now and I'm going to open my new planner because this is important. So you guys have like the worst view ever. This is it. It says it's cool to be kind. It has a... What's this called? No, it's called a bookmark. It has a bookmark for where you're at in the planner. I'm so excited. It's so pretty. It says, don't give up on your daydream. This happy planner student edition. Now, sadly, we've missed all of August, but we're going to start up in September, even though it's like the end of September. I love it because it, ha it has the week and then it also has like goals. So it has like, don't forget, upcoming tasks, and then I'm feeling, which I think is good little mental health thing it's so pretty oh this one says this is like wise words so i can put quotes there oh my god i also just noticed it has like weekend plans that's so cute and then what i love about happy planner is that at the end of each month going into the next month you have like a page to reflect so this kit came with the planner our nice little bookmarky guy and then like note pages some post-it notes, washi tape, and some stickers, not very many. I do have other stickers, but yay. There's so much packaging. This came to $14 in the end, which is just insane that I got this for $14 in my mind. On Tuesday, I worked an eight hour shift and didn't really film. This is all I have. So yeah, on Wednesday, Wednesday started with an orderly morning shift and then I went home, uploaded a video, which you're about to see, and did some homework. I just finished uploading my Apple Orchard video Mackie and Mackie's hearing my Mackie voice that I use for her. Eh? 
That's you. Oh my goodness. And then Thursday arrived and I woke up at the early hour of 7.30 a.m. and got right on my laptop and started doing some schoolwork before I brought Mac to the hairdressers so that she could get a nice pop cut because she was looking really rough. And then it was back to work. Okay, hey guys, I'm kind of failing with this vlog. Life has been pretty rough while I'm filming it, but I am now at work. It's about 2.15, I work at 2.30, so I'm about to go in. Things are crazy here, so I obviously am not gonna get into it. It's like personal stuff and with my store, not internet stuff, but it's time to mask up. So we'll get this guy on and I'm ready to go in. Not excited to work because of stuff going on, but we've got to do this thing. And then when I get home, I, my brother and his girlfriend are coming over for dinner. So that's pretty exciting. And yeah, I will see you guys after I work. Hopefully if I remember to film because this week in life has been crazy, but that's what online school is like, especially when you're working during it and during a pandemic. So let's do this thing and let's go. I'm off when I'm time to go to the car. Oh my god, today was crazy. Let's just say I got hit on, but everyone else also got hit on, so it was fine. <sighs> crazy times. I'm on my way home. My parents got sushi, so I'm excited to go and enjoy that. Let's do this. I'm so tired. <laughs> Exactly what I needed after a hard day. Oh, is that apple peel treat? Apples picked by the Number eight. You went apple picking. We made some of it into apple treat. Mmm, so good. Beans. More apple peel? Oh my god. Who is so lucky? So delicious. Friday started with a 8.30 a.m. lecture via video, so that was great. Now that my first class is done, Mac and I are going on a trip to the mailbox because I had a Poshmark order. So I'm gonna go drop that off. I like to get it done before I forget about it. So we're gonna go do that. Right, Mac? You're coming along for the ride. And then I have to clean my room. I have a meeting with somebody at my school and then another class this afternoon and drinks with two of my friends. So busy day, let's do this thing. We did it, Mac. Our package is in. All right, let's go home. I'm having sushi leftovers while I edit some well, this video action for you guys. Mm, so good. I then took some time to do some planning while I watched Jane the Virgin. And then it was time for dinner. My mom and dad actually got a hold of this fun kit where you go to the restaurant, pick it up. It's by Visa Infinite. And then you get to actually make a five course meal at home. It's for two people, but we fed the three of us, which was really great. Oh, it's awesome. Nice blueberry on your lip. <laughs> well, this night took a turn. <laughs> a gin soaked turn. <laughs> I really liked the gin and blueberry drink. It's good. Or the equivalent of two of them. <laughs> well, now it's dessert time. Is that a meringue? Mm -hmm. Yes. It's a a green tea matcha meringue Ooh. with lemon curd. What are the berries? Lemon curd, blackberry, and peach. This is blackberry peach, so you gotta have some of that. And then meringue and ginger crisps. Oh, you gotta get some of the, the lemon curd too. I'm not a big curdy person. And green tea matcha. Okay. 
Okay, hey guys, I am once again getting ready for work. It is 2.45 and I work at three, so I'm about to go in and get situated. Yeah, I don't wanna work at all. There's just a lot of shit going on at work. Sorry I didn't film this morning. We just had brunch and I read a book for school. When I get home, I'm doing, hopefully doing my Zoom call with some friends and then I need to do some stuff around the house and then tomorrow is our last day of this vlog. It's been a mess, but my life is a mess. So yeah, more updates to come. Sunday started with tiny house videos. Okay, so I'm doing bad at filming today. I've had not the best morning. I'm not going into work today. I'm taking a sick day, which is also why I look grody and I'm wearing sweatpants. You can't see the sweatpants. But I got some great news. I can't tell you guys about it. I feel like a true YouTuber right now. I can't tell you guys about it now, but you guys will be the... <laughs> Click that bell, because you guys will be the first to know when it happens. I got the great news, and my mom just handed me scratcher tickets that she got for her birthday. And was like, since you're lucky right now, let's do it. And I'm not even through, and we won $50. <laughs> I don't know what's happening right now. <laughs> the dog's having a good day too, because she got to lick crepes, and we just won $50. <laughs> COVID? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Today started with a COVID scare, getting a phone call from Ottawa Public Health. So I'm home right now. Um, but yeah, I'll let you guys know if I win more money. Do you want to come play? Okay, hey guys, thank you for watching this video. It was very much a mess, but as I kept saying in the video, this is what online school is like. I just wanted to end this video. It is now Tuesday of the week after posting this video today, actually. Online school is hard, and to everyone going through it right now, I commend you, you're doing an amazing job. It's gonna be difficult to anybody who's taking a full course load. Like, good job, you are killing it. Keep doing what you're doing, and I couldn't do it. In fact, the week that you saw was week two or three of all my courses. I'm getting lost already and it's not that far into school. I was taking three classes. I do have a learning disability, so I have a really hard time with online school. And I ended up dropping to only two courses because I could not sustain three. If you guys are doing a full course load, you are amazing. If you're not doing a full course load, you're still amazing. No matter what, this is difficult. It's unprecedented times. And I know people are throwing up that term a lot. As much as there have been pandemics before, we have not seen a pandemic to this extent in our lifetimes. And nobody going through school has ever experienced this. So good job. You're making history right now. It's insane. Like no one has ever gone from being in school and then had their whole life change and want to be in classes and enrolled in classes at a university or even high school and all of that and be suddenly in a position where we're doing it all online against our will. Keep up the good work. I also wanted to touch on my work stuff that I kept talking about not wanting to go to work. There was a COVID scare where I am. Today while I'm filming this, we had our biggest one day jump of COVID cases here in Ottawa. We had 106 today, which is the most we've seen since the beginning of the pandemic in one day. Like we made history today, which is not the history we want to make and it's not a goal. The second wave is upon us. Stay safe out there. If you are able to be home, be home. Obviously people need to go to stores and need to go get groceries and things like that, which you saw me do in this video. My family and I are always wearing masks. It's mandatory here. If it's not mandatory where you are, just be conscious and choose to wear a mask. It helps. It truly, truly does. After what I have gone through last week, it has really shown me how masks can make a difference and do make a difference. No one wants to get COVID and those who have it are not, it's not their fault by any means so everyone is a victim to it we're all victims to all of this so just keep that in mind 
while you're living life and the truth is there might be you might come in contact with somebody who has it and you, they don't know and you don't know and we just need to be smart and to continue to be vigilant washing our hands wear masks it's the same thing i've preached in other videos I feel like it's the same talk that i gave in my going back to work which was about three four months ago now so just wear a mask be safe be good when you're out at stores same thing i said in that video be nice to workers you first of all don't know what they're going through in their personal lives that make things any bit harder you also don't know how their anxiety is dealing with the pandemic and you don't know what is happening in that certain workplace so just be nice people are losing their jobs um they don't know where the money is going to come if there's a second shutdown they don't know hopefully where i am if there is a second shutdown hopefully there will be some money coming in from the government but we don't know everything's up in the air so just be nice if you have a job that's stable and you're working from home that's amazing good for you you're doing the right thing working from home if you're in a point where you have to go to work and work at a restaurant work at a store work anywhere that is public facing be safe know your boundaries and do not be afraid to set those boundaries at this time your job cannot be mad at you if you are taking your health and the health of others into account in everyday life so i just wanted to say that don't want to make this outro too long or half the video but yeah thank you guys for watching and thank you for the person who suggested making this video it was actually really fun and i need video ideas so again comment down below if you have any video ideas subscribe as well because i'm going to be making a lot more videos i'm working on a more elaborate uh, project right now focusing on mental health and yeah so have a great day guys and i'll see you in the next one bye We've got